Okay, so I just wanted to do a video on the uh, new headphones that I've been using quite recently. Um, they are the... I'm making an actual <laughs> name on them. They're the Studio Pro 50s from uh, One Audio. But I gotta say, these headphones, they are quite amazing. I've, I've owned them for quite a few months. I forget when I actually bought them. Uh, but it's been quite a few months since I've got it. They uh, they have a nice build. I mean, they're not, you know, the most amazing build. They are quite plastic all the way around, except for the little metal syringe. It has a little bit of a sound to it, but it's it's quite solid. Um, I guess the uh, one audio that's actually, if I point it towards the name, it has the name there. But they are, other than the plastic, and this probably is a ceramic with a aluminum uh, finish, usually what is most things. But it's understandable due to the fact that they were like $45 when I bought them. Um, but they are very, very comfortable. Most of the headphones that I have used, have had, um, I've used the Corsair HSB. 50, I forget what the name is, but it's from Corsair. They're wireless. The mic isn't that great, but the uh, the quality headphones are pretty well good. But um, after about, I think, six months or so, I've used them. The earmuffs started to wear out, and they, they hurt my ears a lot towards the back end, especially when I'm playing for more than three hours. They start to really rub out, and I really have to, like, resituate them. I've had the Astro, the Astro's 10 for the, specifically for the Xbox, and it really, like, it smashes <laughs> on top of my head and it hurts, but these, these ones, the uh, Studio Fit, uh, Pro 50s, they are probably one of the most comfortable headphones I've ever used. They do pack a 50 millimeter driver or magnet speaker whatever you want to call it into the headphones so they have a very good dynamic range in their headphones it doesn't i mean there's a possibility that the um the outer like pseudo leather will come apart soon enough because it no matter what you have it's going to do that but um it's it's been great so far it looks like they've stitched it it looks it looks good it's it's not so much of a hey i'm this hey hey i'm branded hey 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 it's very low profile it's nice i like it uh it does have twistable it is set for djs and all the other sorts of stuff for your live studios to where you can just pull it out but it does have left and right markings very inside of the thing you have to actually look at it for it to see it um but they're comfortable they sound great they are fairly cheap for what they are um, the way to use them I'll get to that here in a second is through a wire there is actually two wires there there's I think there's two drivers within here uh, there is the regular 3.5 millimeter jack that you would use any type of head, um, aux cord or anything like that for it and then there is also the whatever it's called for, <laughs> for your guitars speakers and all that type of stuff that has the bigger one in there they do require power um enough power to go i think it's like a five volt they require that much power to go into these or else they will not work i didn't know that when i bought it um i just thought it would plug and play uh, they would work a little bit and then they would kind of go out they would there would be an issue there and so i was looking around and i figured out that it actually needs a audio interface for it to actually be powered so I looked around and I got the Fozzy Audio, the DAC, the DAC Q4, there's a cat outside my window. Um, it has USB optical uh, KO, <laughs> I don't know how you say that, uh, but it's it's a quite good interface. It was uh, rather cheap and it's it's been great for me. I have a PC uh, USB on there. It does a DC five volt. And you can go quaxle and optical and right and left. I just have it plugged into the headphones, which with the he the headset itself, it comes with one other cord, and it comes with this major one right here. 
This one, you have a bit of a spring to it, which allows you to stretch a little bit. But the great thing about this one is if I can grab it, it has the regular 3.5 uh, millimeter, and then also comes with your bigger one, and it converts it to that, which I generally have this plugged into the side with the bigger mount. It has a good click to it. It uh, snaps into there, which is great. And then you just connect your smaller one into the interface as I drop it, and it has a nice good click to it. And then you just turn it on and you play. You have, I have it connected to the PC and then plugged in and you just, it has a good click. And then you turn up, You this thing provides a lot of sound. You really don't have to have it up for you to be able to actually hear it, which is great. And then you can adjust more bass and treble to it, which has a, not, has a nice tactile feel to it, which is great. You can feel the notches. I don't ever use it for that purpose i just have it plugged in and listen to it and it's great i love the sound quality in there I, it has great dynamics to it so um, i can hear the bass and the high the treble everything very well and i gotta say they are comfortable um now for i, I kind of almost wish i bought the wireless ones too just for the fact of playing VR and whatnot to have the high quality audio while also playing and that way I didn't have a cord in the way but and maybe something I looked into into the future but uh, <laughs> they're, they're great I do have an affiliate link down below that you can look at and I'll also have a link for the audio interface I am not this video isn't sponsored it, there is an affiliate but there's no sponsor to it but I just I wanted to make a review on them because they I just I love them a lot they've worked very well for me it's been my pretty much go-to if I'm listening to music if I'm doing anything with audio and I care to actually have headphones on um, I'll actually go to these straight off the bat and have this is some ni enough nice words to be able to just turn it on and automatically it comes into it default and they're just, they're wonderful. <laughs> I fall asleep a lot of times when I'm wearing them because they're so comfortable. They don't hurt my ears. They're very nice. They have nice, nice finish to that. They're nice and soft. They don't get in the way. And the only time it actually gets into a hard part is whenever you get to the actual speaker. But you, you sh your ear shouldn't be against that anyways. But they are great. So... If you want the, they have multiple different things that you can buy on their website. You can go look. They even have, looks like they have a Black Friday sale, buy one, get one free going on. Looks like they have earbuds and all sorts of stuff. They even have one with a wireless or yeah, probably wireless, but a, a microphone. Wow. Can't think of words today, but um, yeah, I just, they're, they're good. They're nice. I like them.